the outlines of Ukraine, the author's vision of the country's coat of arms, ears of wheat, poppies, poems by Taras Shevchenko, and final words of Ukrainian bodyguards on where the Russian warship should go, which became an iconic statement of national resistance both within and outside of Ukraine. Thousands of Ukrainians get the symbol of this terrible war on their bodies. This is a kind of memory and pride for them. And for tattoo artists it's an opportunity to help the Ukrainian military. They donate much of income to the Ukrainian armed forces. Natalia, the owner of tattoo shop in the city of Lviv, says there hasn't been such a high demand for patriotic tattoos since 2014. Both locals and internally displaced persons come to the tattoo artists with their sketches and ideas. The employees decided at once that they work on the principle, get a tattoo, help the armed forces of Ukraine. We do patriotic tattoos and send 70% of our income to help the armed forces of Ukraine. Now we are starting to send the money to volunteers. People are doing patriotic tattoos with images and symbols of Ukraine because everyone is sure that victory is ours. People want to show citizenship not only in the passport but also on the body. And for this tattoo shop located in the city of Winnica, it's a matter of honor to get patriotic tattoos. One of the artists is now serving in the armed forces. Half a hundred patriotic tattoos have been done here since the war began. Outlines of Ukraine, quotes from poems, anthems, Molotov cocktails and... And of course, final words of Ukrainian border guards on where the Russian warship should go. Patriotic tattoos are not just a new trend. They are a way to express love for Ukraine, gratitude to the armed forces of Ukraine and raise morale. We spend most of the money on the needs of the internally displaced persons, on the purchase of goods necessary for those who have found shelter in Vinnytsia. In addition, the patriotic tattoos commemorative ones are also made. For example, an artist from Kiev shared the story of one such tattoo online. A client asked to make a tattoo inscription in her husband's handwriting. The man was killed in the town of Irpin, a suburb of Kiev, when Russian occupants shelled the city. Tattoo artists say it's not only a trend but an additional factor of identification. It's a symbol that Ukrainians want to remember this difficult but so important and defining time for everyone. Not everyone can fight, but everyone can help on their front. Reported by Roman Smoller, Yulia Bezborodko, UATV News.